Welcome back to tonight's Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. In the hot seat, we have George Woolley, who's just won 15,000 gems. Now, I can't wait to tell you this. You have no lifelines left. Yes! But the next question is for a 40th of a million. The 25k. In if city can hit on, it's in a foreign language. It's been written backwards. It's the end of the world! <laughs> I need a 25k. Well then guess. So you hopefully get it wrong and make a fool of yourself. It can't be D. I don't think it's A. A different question has been written in a foreign language. So are you going to go for it? It was for a greater sum of money, I would walk away. But I'm about 60% sure, and that is more than half. So I'm going to say B, final answer. Nope, it was C, which means you lose 10,000 yen. But you do get this iPod Touch to replace your Zune, which I think is a pretty good trade. I'll still see you in court. Whatever. Ladies and gentlemen, George Woolley. So George Woolley leaves with a 64 gigabyte iPod Touch and 5,000 gems, a tenth of what he really wanted. You know, I said Zune suck, but an iPod Touch is no better. What you really want is an iPhone. Anyway, you. Oh God, how many are there? Five, five, five contestants. I have a question for you. Okay, this fussy thing first is a little different from the other ones. Don't worry guys, I'll explain everything to you. The question is... Put these letters in order to form the following word. And the word is... Oh, it's, it's, it's word. D-O-R-W And for those of you that's answered it very quickly, here is the correct Amundo Ordori Rooney. It's W O R D. Or for those of you technically, DBCA is what you would have to have pressed on your keypads. So it could be a little confusing. So, let's see, you actually got that right. Everyone did. Everyone got it in 4 seconds except for Trevor, got it a little bit faster with 2.37 Yes! Yes! Oh yes! So ladies and gentlemen, our next contestant, Trevor McCoy! So... In the hot seat, we have Trevor McCoy. Trevor is a student at college. Is that right? Yes, I go to a little college in Sundown. Um, you're 17. That's right. And that makes you the youngest contestant so far to sit in the hot seat. Wow, that's amazing. It is amazing. And um, I hear rumours you've got a girlfriend. I do, yes I do. She's 20, so she's a little older than me. But I don't mind, you know. It doesn't feel like it at all. And what does your girlfriend do? Uh, her name's Sally, and she's a 999 operator. Really? So if I made a call... You're likely to get her, yeah. Wow. So then, Trevor... I don't know, would you just like to get on with it, or...? What? Is there anything you want to tell me? I'm Trevor, I currently go to college, and I'm on my first year of A-levels. Okay, well, is that going well? 
Uh, yeah, it is. I've just finished my AS and now uh, moving on to my A2, so, yeah, it's getting exciting. Well, good for you. Trevor! Yeah? Do you want to play? Yeah, okay, let's do it. Okay, so Trevor, 11 questions, 1 million gems, ready to play? Yeah. This first question is for 1,000 gems, here it is. When a cat is happy, what will it do? Will it purr? Will it growl? Will it sleep? Or will it steal your car keys? <laughs> I don't know. Every t every week, every week, you get questions like this. They just crack me up. Yeah, I've, I've been wanting to chuckle back when I hear what some of these questions are. Um, this is definitely my favourite. Because <laughs> I'm a cat, and when I'm happy, I purr. So it's A. You've just won 1,000 gems. Yeah! <laughs> okay. This next one is for 2,000 gems. Which of these drinks doesn't contain alcohol? Lager? Champagne? Ale? Non-alcoholic beer? Uh, it should be non-alcoholic beer. Of course not, because it doesn't contain alcohol. It's 2,000 gems. <laughs> now for 5,000 gems. Last point, you can go home with nothing, Trevor. But you know what? Stay calm. That will not happen. Here it is then. How many minutes do Justin Timberlake and Madonna have to save the world? One minute? Two minutes? Three minutes? Four minutes? My god. How, do, how am I meant to know that? Uh, I'm not really one to get into music unless, you know, it, I'm not usually, that's not usually the type of music that I'm interested in. Well, what are you interested in? Well, you know, just kind of, I do like a bit of, um, 70s, 80s kind of music, but not only this modern stuff, auto-tuning and all that. I'm not saying they all are, but I just can't get into modern music. It's just not for me. Can I ask the audience, please? Um, yes, of course you can. Audience, on your keypads, this is for a guaranteed 5,000 gems. Um, here is the question. How many minutes do Justin Timberlake and Madonna have to save the world? A minute, two minutes, three minutes, and four minutes. Anyway, guys, on your keypads A, B, C, or D, all votes now. So, the majority say D, how surprising. 80% of them say D, actually. Okay. Well, 80% is a very strong percentage. Four minutes, final answer. I'd like to shake your hand because you just won 5,000 gems! Yes! Yes! So you got 5,000 gems, you can still 50 50 and you can still find a friend, so you know what? You're still doing very well. Okay. 10,000 gems then. With what did the people of Uruguay temporarily replace the number 69 with in 1999? 68 and 3 quarters, Nixty sign, 1 less than 70, 5019. Well, you know what? It is a bit of a rude number, isn't it? Have you ever done anything to do with 69? Puzzle? I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not saying anything like that. Okay, sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Could be kids watching. Nah. You know the only people that watch this program are sad people on YouTube. Hey, just joking, guys. <laughs> I'm not. So, Trevor? What do you think it is? I think it's 5019. Final answer? Yeah. We'll be right back after the break, don't go anywhere. <laughs>